Hi guys, me again. <laughs> um, I'm going to deliver your science lesson for you today. Um, it's can I label a body? Now we have done something similar um, a whole term ago now, but I want you to think back to that lesson because you're going to need that information for this for this lesson. Okay, let's give it a go. Okay, so the first job. I would like you to look at your grown up who you who you sat next to or who you're working with or someone in the room, and I want you to talk to them and find something similar about you both and find something different. So you might have the same eye colour, but you might have a different hair colour or you might be similar in height. Have a think and I want you to tell your grown up now something similar and something different. Off you go. Welcome back. So the key vocabulary you're going to need today, we've got body, face, arms, legs and limbs. Can anyone remember what limbs was? What did limbs mean? Limbs does, you're right. Limbs means your arms and your legs. OK, so keep an eye and ear out for these keywords. Off we go. So in class, like I said, a whole term ago, we drew around Bella and we labelled her body parts, didn't we? So we thought about what the body part was called. We written it down on post-it notes and we stuck it all over the drawing of Bella. Does anyone remember doing that? Well done. What I want you to do now is just shout out as many body parts as you can remember. Off you go. Go. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, well done, guys. Okay, can you think of any body parts that we can't see? And where do they live in your body? If your body was the place, where would they live? I'll give you two minutes. Speak to your grown up. Okay, you may have thought of. What's that? That's the brain. Where does it live? Points where it lives. It lives in our skull, in our head, doesn't it? What else could do you think we couldn't can't see? Does anyone know what that is? That's our heart. Points where your heart lives. It lives just under your chest, doesn't it? Just in your chest, not under, in your chest. <laughs> What's next? And your lungs. They live just a little bit further down than your heart and they help you to breathe. OK. So your task today, I want you to choose a body part. It could be one that you can't see by looking in the mirror or it could be one that you can see looking in the mirror. OK, and I want you to do a bit of research and I want you to find out three interesting facts to share with us. OK, but I want you to think about ones that you think nobody else knows none of your friends will know it so i'm going to choose that one nobody knows that one okay they're the facts that i want they're really really good ones okay share them on your portfolio and i cannot wait to do some more learning because i'm going to read them all and i'm going to have a brain this big okay so i look forward to seeing it soon thank you bye